hello everyone this is providencia welcome to my channel i am here with a huge all these haul yes i had to go to all these today you know why well number one we needed food <laughs> uh, we were so low on everything i'm not even kidding you and on top of that i haven't gone to all these in a few a few months number like what two three months around there and there was a good sale and I had to go there. I was like, no, 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 no. Now it's going to end tomorrow. So I'm hoping I put this video up today for maybe you could grab it tomorrow. I was trying to go when the sale did start it, but I was just too busy. The chicken was 69 cents a pound and I said I have to go and buy a few packs. Nine packs. <laughs> I'll show you that in a minute. You know that I always do the meats last because, you know bacteria you know counter and all that other stuff so i like to do the meat last for that way i could just clean and disinfect my counter but anyway let's start this haul i have a whole bunch of stuff i try to categorize it as much as i can and yeah okay so let's go this is all like breads you know crackers and stuff like that i'm gonna show you the crackers in a minute i got two english muffins if you hear cracking it's my cat's they're eating their food right now. Mm -hmm. I got two of those English muffins. I bought some Hawaiian sweet rolls. I also bought chopped meat. I'm going to show it to you. Ground beef um, in a minute. So I want to make some burgers with some pepper jack cheese. And some lettuce and all that good stuff. So I bought some hamburger buns. I also bought everything bagels. I love everything bagels. Oh, and the raisin bagels. Those are like my favorites. And then I got two um, white bread. And those are for the kids. But I bought this for me and my older son and his girlfriend. Um, these breads for when I do the burgers and stuff like that. You know how I am when I do a food video or even take a picture and put it on Instagram or social media. I like to make sure that my food has great presentation. So that's why I bought these um, buns. And I also bought six, no, one, two, four, six, seven, seven boxes of crackers. They were like 75 cents a piece. And the reason why I bought so much is because like during the month we could probably waste three i know more or less what you know how much we need for the month you know as far as food okay and i did buy my mother um i believe i bought four for her because she loves these crackers and she's unable to get it in the bronx so i told her i bought you you know some crackers and stuff you know for you and that's why I bought seven. So this is it for this section. Let's go on to the next. All right, so here we have snacks. I know it's a lot. I know it's a lot. But like I said, this is gonna last for a few weeks, okay? They they don't eat everything in, in one shot. And you gotta also understand, I got, I got four boys. I got, go ahead, take it out. My son is scared to make noise. <laughs> um, I got um, my son's girlfriend that you know lives with me i got the two grandkids it's a lot you know so it is what it is um but anyhow um let me go into details with this i got two packs of these um i didn't get the other ones the blue bags which is not the chewy ones because they was a little bit more expensive this was a little bit cheaper so that's why i bought these two of them i bought the fudge strip um cookies those are really good i've had those oatmeal cream pies honey buns i bought um cheese puffs for my granddaughter she loves cheese puffs i bought um toaster tarts frosted chocolate fudge some white um cheddar cheese crackers right here I also bought two boxes of Swiss rolls because my kids love, you know, Swiss rolls. And I also got these for my son, Peanut. You know, Peanut loves his little coffee. 
and yeah that way he could have it with coffee as well and I got some peanut butter and jelly right there some Nutella may I add that this Nutella tastes really really good it tastes like um not Nutella you know hazelnut I said it wrong <laughs> It tastes exactly like the Nutella though. Really, really good. And in my own opinion, and this is just my opinion alone, I feel like this is a little bit more cream, like creamier than the Nutella one is. Like for some reason. As you can see, my son already went and took a little scoop of it. <laughs> but I was like, I'm going to put it in my hole. Also some gum. This is for my son as well. He likes gum. This I bought for my son's girlfriend. She loves these cookies. So I bought that for her. I bought me some corn chips because next to the to you know the store where I live at, they never have corn chips in the store. And I love corn chips. What is corn chips and salt and vinegar? Those are like my chips. And they never have corn chips. So I was like, I'm gonna get me two bags for I could I could have for a while. Also, peanut butter wafers. And I bought that one for myself. Fruit and grain soft baked bar. I've never had this one. Um, if I if I taste it, you know, before I do this video, I will definitely leave a caption letting you know if it was good. They had other varieties as well. But I'm going to taste this one first, you know, to see how it is. All right. Now, all of these snacks, yeah, like... Everyone likes a certain like snack, you know, you get you get what I'm saying So that's what I try to do, you know, like I know My my son loves peanut butter wafers um, My other son peanut loves honey buns and My granddaughter likes this so it's like I always try to buy like the snacks that they like their preference and that's why it always looks like it's a lot, okay? Um, so, yeah, just want to point that out. And let's go to the next section. Okay, so this is the breakfast section. Well, at least that's what I call it. <laughs> and I have three dozen of eggs. I bought Cafe Bustelo. I bought butter. I also bought this. Never had it. Well, I don't think I ever did. 100% um, Colombian. Let's see how that is i also bought different creamers now these two i have had the original one and the french vanilla yes we've had those in the house as far as this one this will be new for us butter cookie coffee creamer and i'm just curious how this will taste with coffee that's why i bought it <laughs> and two bags of sugar i also bought sausages i bought four packs of those and even though this is not for breakfast, this is really for the hamburger I mentioned earlier. But I just wanted to put it here because it is cheese. I bought some pepper jack cheese. Okay. And yeah, this is a small little section right here. But let's go on to the next section. Here we got the cereal section. But first, I want to show you the milks. I bought three gallons of milk. And let me go through the cereals real quick with you guys. I got two boxes of marshmallows and stars. I love that. I like these two. They taste really good. All right. And cocoa peanut butter. No, peanut butter. <laughs> peanut butter puffs. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Cinnamon crunch squares. I got two boxes of those. This I bought for me, so I hope these kids don't eat them. Like honey, it. well, I know Chunky <laughs> does. Honey Crunch and Oats. Yum. And two boxes of cocoa rice. Okay. And that was quick, so let's go on to the next section. And before I forget, because it seems like every time I buy pizza, I always forget to show you the pizza because they be like hidden somewhere. Um, I got two boxes of pizzas. This one is five cheeses and this is pepperoni and I'm definitely gonna make this tonight for dinner. We're gonna have pizza because I have I'm still doing this haul and I gotta 
clear out the refrigerator, put everything away, and all that other good stuff. And I don't want to wear myself out cooking dinner today. So, this is what we're going to have today. Okay, so let's go to the next section. <laughs> I got a whole bunch of canned goods. And, <laughs> and I'm going to show you what I have. Okay, so I have all these ramen soups. All right. Now, I only bought one pack of chicken. Okay, because for some reason... Beef is famous in this There house. you go. The kids love the beef ones. So I bought two of those. I like the chicken one better rather than the beef. So I think this one probably is going to be mine. Mine's and, and, and peanuts. peanuts. Yeah, because he don't, he don't really like the beef one. But you can't lie. Like, it literally says roasted beef. Like What, no. what catches your eyes more than seeing roasted beef? No, I like it. <laughs> So put that to the side. Okay, I know I, everything looks pretty neat. It's because you know I gotta do thumbnails. But let's see how we could do this. I got two of these, the fake spam. I also have a jar of pesto. Pesto is really, really, really good with some nice toasted bread with some spaghettis. Oh my goodness. But anyways, um, two cans of tomato paste. Also, I have um, six um, corn muffins. My kids love when I make the corn muffins. They really, really love it. I, I be doing like little tricks to make it taste even better. One of these days, I want to show it to you. My little... I think the, the when you add the honey is with... Ooh. Yeah, with the honey. And I be like adding little things when I'm doing like the mixing and stuff like that. They love it. They swear it's like corn muffin from scratch. I be like, no, that's Jiffy. <laughs> And I have um, two, four, six, eight, yeah, eight. Eight cans of corn right here. My kids are helping me put some stuff away in the pantry. I also bought this um, ranch um, seasoning mix because I do want to make some chicken with this. Oh, so good. Probably I'll do a video on that. So I got two of those. I got four boxes of shells and cheese. I want to show you the box. I'm sorry, I'm not showing it to you. Just a little tired. <laughs> and I got four cans of evaporated milk. I do want to make a recipe with this, uh, limbe. I don't know how to say that in in, in English. I'm gonna see if I could try to. With limbe. Limbe is like the coconut kind of ices, but it's not gonna be coconut. It's gonna be another flavor. I don't know how to help yeah, you Yeah, so, yeah. Um, so, that's why I have it. I really would love to make a recipe on that. I got two of the um, jumbo biscuits. I want to make some sugar donuts with this for the kids. Um, when I can. I got two crescent rolls for dinner. So I got some olives. You know I always love putting olives in my food. I love olives. <laughs> Three jars of tomato, um, um, not tomato, tomato, basil, and garlic pasta sauce. I got four cans of pork and beans. I usually add like a little bit of sugar for it could be really like, you know, like not, not too, too sweet, but you know, bring out the flavor in the pork and beans. Oh, my kids love it. I also got pinto beans, two of them. It's funny because the smaller one was maybe like 10 cents less than this big, big one. So I was like, I'm going to just buy this big one um, because it's 10 cents more and it comes a lot, you know. So I bought that. I bought mayonnaise right here. I got me some dill pickles. I love eating pickles. I could eat pickles like, like that out of the jar. <laughs> Also, I have one can of each garbanzo beans and great northern beans. Now, I'm not going to lie. I'm not a big fan of black beans. I really don't like them, but my husband does. He likes it in rice. He likes it stewed. He just loves black beans. So, that's why I got two cans. I got one ketchup. Also, I got two of these, two spaghettis. Very, very inexpensive. And it's a big, big box right here. Also, I have this can over here, canola spray. I love using these. And I got Thousand Island dressing. And this is going to be new for us. 
um, raspberry vinaigrette dressing. I mean, I'm a little curious how this is going to taste on some salad because I've never, never, never had it. But we shall see. And last, this is called... Pierogi. Pierogi. Pierogies. <laughs> saying it all wrong i've never never had these but my son's girlfriend put me onto it one time she bought it and she offered me some which one was the one that you bought me the last time i think it was like a four cheese one it was so good i've never heard of this never really seen it and since that day i loved it okay so we bought two different kinds spinach and white cheddar per pierogies <laughs> That's how you say it. That's how I say it. Yeah. Okay. Where? where? Yeah. Pyrogi. It looks like pyrogies. it's like pyrogies. pyrogies. That's pyrogies. why. <laughs> but anyways, roasted garlic pyrogies. <laughs> okay, I'm just joking. It's pyrogies. <laughs> All right. So I cannot wait to have these, especially this one, the spinach and white cheddar. I'm just really curious. To see how that tastes me and her and it comes 12 in each one of them you can put it in the microwave you gotta fry them for it says microwave contains keep frozen microwaveable well, I don't know. I like microwave because they come out like crunchy if you put them in the microwave they come out kind of soggy okay forget it i think i'll fry them <laughs> and <laughs> this is it so let's go to the fruits and no no fruits we didn't buy no fruits we bought vegetables let's go to the vegetables next okay so I got vegetables here. All I got is one fruit. <laughs> I know. I got to do better. But I'm, I'm wanting to buy strawberries. But it was like $5. And I was like, nah, I'm not going to buy it. I'll buy it when it starts getting a little cheaper. You know, $1.49, $2 at all these. Then I'll buy them. <laughs> but I'm not buying them now. But anyhow, I got some red onions. Some lemons. I got some lettuce. Um, three avocados, potatoes, cilantro. Also, I bought some green beans. I bought two of them because my kids love when I make some garlicky green beans. They love it. Fresh garlic right here. Some broccoli. Some bananas. They just got to ripe a little bit. I like to buy them like that for that way like within a few days it will be ripe. I got some lettuce, iceberg lettuce, and some peppers, um, the yellow one, green one, and the orange one. And that's basically it. Oh my goodness, that was quick. And these are all of my vegetables, except for one fruit, which is the bananas. Well, actually, you know what? And I learned this a couple years ago. I didn't know that avocado was a fruit. That's right. That's what I heard. That avocado is not really a vegetable. It's really a fruit. I'm going to double check that. Because I don't want to say something. And then people make me look stupid on YouTube. Like no you got it wrong. And everything like that. But that's what I heard. Okay. So this is um, this section right here. And the last section is coming up next. Which is the meat. So we'll be back. I even forgot to mention that I bought this. This was the only two items that I bought that was not food related this is um what is this called banana hanger with fruit basket isn't that beautiful and you can separate them this was ten dollars and it's heavy too you know it's very heavy duty um i am gonna separate them in a minute but you can see it because it's it's you know it's, the, it's attached and also the only thing that also interested me was this um, this was like three and change and I did wanted some wooden spoons especially this one the first one was the one that I really was gonna buy at eBay or um, Amazon so I'm glad that I got it really really cheap five pieces for three and change okay so I'm gonna detach this for you could you know see more or less how it looks all right so this is the way it looks I mean, you could put it like this in the wall. At least that's how I'm going to do it. All I got is a few apples. <laughs> so it's not that much fruit. All right. And you can see it more better. Okay. What is this? Oh, this is a piece of the package. Okay. And this is how it looks. Oh, my goodness. I want to cook now. But you could take it out. Let me 
touch on the side and voila very nice beautiful you get two for one for ten bucks okay all right now we can do the meat now we're almost finished we'll be back and this is the last section yes now I have a whole bunch of meat but we're gonna get a deep freezer so that's a good thing well at least we're trying to get one for like a good price but this is all the meat that we have oh my goodness yes I have eight not nine in the beginning of the video I said nine but it's eight packs of chicken drumsticks all right now over here it says 99 cents a pound but no 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 it was a sale for 69 cents a pound all right so I bought eight now I could make a lot of recipes with with chicken drumsticks you can make them fried you can make them stewed you can make them baked. you can make it barbecue ish you could do it in the air fryer you could use different seasonings so we're not gonna get bored with this and you know just in case you know and it does last us like at least like maybe two or three months in the freezer okay so it's not like we're gonna eat all of this at once the reason why i bought so much is like i said because it was a sale and then i had to grab it so that's eight packs we have here boneless chicken breast those were 189 a pound and it's 936. usually i cut them very like thin slice and this could feed my whole family also some um ground beef because you know like you know i'm gonna make some some burgers very soon so the, that was 249 at 13 13 at 45 cents I didn't buy a lot of pork chops because I do have pork chops in the freezer. So all I bought was one pack just in case that I don't have. I think I have like maybe two or three packs of pork chops. But I bought one just in case. <laughs> and that was $2.49 and this is $10.18. Also, I bought four packs of hot dogs. All right. I think those was like, what, 79 cents for each. So I bought four packs. All right. Like I said, I didn't buy a lot of meat besides the chicken, of course, the chicken legs, because I already got a whole bunch of meat in the freezer. And I'm really trying to see like deep freezers for a cheap price because we do need a deep freezer um, for when I want to buy a lot of meat, like by the bulk, especially if it's a sale. I like to buy a whole bunch of packs and have it in the freezer. So that's why there's eight packs and stuff. So, yep. By the way, I'm probably going to do one of these packs and do a, a video on it, but in the air fryer, okay? Because I made some chicken drumsticks the other day, and everybody loved it in the air fryer. Oh, they, so yeah, you, you heard it. They were really, really good. So I was like, hmm, I'm going to probably do a video on that, you know, for, for anyone who does have an air fryer. Now, I know a lot of people don't have air fryers. But this, like, that's the thing now. Everybody has, like, a lot of people has air fryers now. So, for, for that reason and stuff. But I'll give you other options how you could also probably fry it and all that other stuff. So, now I'm going to put all of this stuff away. Everybody's going to help me. Gling, gling. And, yeah, that's about it. So, take care. God bless. I hope you enjoyed this haul. And I will see you in the next video. Bye. Okay, for now, the deep freezer is here where it's not supposed to be at because my cabinets are on the other side but it's only for now because until i move a few things around i'm moving stuff around in this house this week go ahead nene do the demonstration ready one two three go all right so this is a state-of-the-art deep freezer Purchased directly from Home Depot. <laughs> and voila! We've, we've got amazing lighting to view our inventory of products inside of this deep freezer. Okay, now, so we have like shelving that is adjustable that you can move. So, you know, whatever you're liking. You have your little lean bears here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah, oh, yeah. Pisces there. No, that's why I'm gonna put the lean bears in the other freezer. Something like that. And you got a gate here. You know, 
Maybe you want to stack some meat up on this side. There we are. You know, maybe if you're a fun-loving type of person, put a few beers here. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> it's state of the art. Yes. It's already cold, and we yes, just put it in two, three oh, minutes. Oh, <laughs> and wait a minute, and let's not forget, I say what? Wait. No, you only pay thirty dollars a year because it's energy efficient. Mm -hmm. Are you seeing? 